Breakups can be very difficult to deal with from the grieving process to healing and somebody who has been sharing that journey with her fans is Lydia KM from TMI Podcast and she has shared that right now she has found her joy. She's not grieving and in fact she's planning to do a breakup workshop. Let's get into it. Welcome to Efax number one stop to entertainment and trending news. So when Lydia announced or made the announcement that she was single and that she had ended things or rather her relationship with Mike had come to an end, fans who are very much in love with this couple, in awe with the couple, were shocked because this was news that they were not expecting just a few months and even through the months the couple seemed to be very much in love. In fact, Lydia will relish on how beautiful she felt how much at peace she would feel around her man and so when such news came out that they had gone their separate ways fans could not believe it anyway they have been very gracious walking through this journey with Lydia as she is healing and she has been also very honest with her fans letting them know when she has her low days when she has her high days what she has been doing just get to that happy place where you are no longer grieving your breakup in fact she had put out that she has been doing self-care a lot of that therapy meditation working out keeping herself busy and most importantly the people that she put out to have made her go through this very well is her support system and actually she had shared on her insta stories a few people mentioning them as to how they were supportive of her and something that she had also shared is that sometimes when you get into a relationship you completely lose yourself your work your friends and family take a hit because you are overly invested in the relationship i did that once and i promised myself that i will always keep all the other things that bring me joy close to me and the beauty of it is that you are never alone in any season of your life sometimes one area will be taking more of you for a season and that's okay but you deserve a big full life filled with love wherever you look do you find it hard or easy to keep other things running while in a relationship and she shared a very beautiful video of her with her friends having a good time and so basically what she was putting out that even though she was in a relationship and she was fully invested in it she made sure that the people close to her were also in there and even with the breakup she still found some joy through her friends anyway she has been getting a lot of messages she has been sharing those as well and people who are going through heartbreak and are in that grieving process and they're questioning her asking her how are you dealing with this give us tips and all that so as you can see this is one message that she got hey Lydia I'm depressed literally how do you get a heartbreak so seamlessly perhaps they meant how do you get out of a heartbreak and uh, Lydia responded seamlessly guys I have just been intentional I felt everything in the most intense way but then when you're done processing that's it feel it all I also equipped myself with every resource I could find because your therapist isn't on call so you'll have to deal on your own most of the times and so she shared this as well glad to see you making new happy memories i prayed for you and while i know you are still grieving i'm sending you love and peace to live up to your purpose every day and she responded i'm no longer grieving i've processed and gently easing into my life as it is and with this she captioned the small residue left will pass with time but i'm fine now guys thank you so much for your daily prayers and encouragement encouragement. And so with all this encouragement and of course some people feel that perhaps Lydia is still grieving she did put out that she's already found her joy will be getting to listen to that but also something else that she has on the wax is that she's planning a better breakup workshop and as you can see we feel we deal we heal we move and she shared more details to follow so since many people have been contacting her have been messaging her asking how are you dealing 
dealing with this so that you can deal and she is putting it out that now she plans to do a workshop to help other people heal as she is let's just get to listen to that hey guys hi babs how are you guys i hope you're doing fantastic i am doing good myself guys um so maybe the last two weeks is when i felt a lot more myself a lot more like oh my god life is not gonna end um the optimism about life is back my joy in social situations which was just like can I go home right now um, has gotten back. Also, there's a thing you feel like there's something wrong with your life because you are used to seeing it a particular way. That's no longer feeling that way. I just feel like this is my life. Um, so I'm feeling a lot better, guys. Thank you so much for all the encouragement. Oh, my gosh. Every time I went in my DMs, there was someone who was encouraging and praying for me. Um, but I am doing I am doing a lot better. We thank God. It's been like a difficult period, um, but we're slowly getting out of it. And as I said, the little residue, that is time that's going to allow it to pass. There are many reasons why I've been able to deal with this um, in a seamless way. Um, but yeah. We think all the time someone sends me a message or I like seeking advice on how they can get past their heartbreak I'm just like I don't know where to start because it can't be it, a voice note won't do it there's so much to do um there's so much I did do so I want to make it intentional it's going to be two weeks where I'm going to be sharing my resources um the things that guided me through the stages of grief the things that guided me through some of the limiting beliefs about love about relationships about myself that I had to get past because one of the things about this breakup is that I told myself I don't want a breakup where it's like the same typical thing where you are left with the resentment and all the emotions and all the negative things and you think it's for someone else but it's no it's it's left in you and it affects you and it affects the way that you go about life the way that you see life and i just didn't want that so since i've had a better breakup i would love to guide those who are going through the same experience um to have a better one too so yeah well so now that lydia is coming to that end of that healing process as she has put it out that there's just a little bit of residue remaining but she will be okay and right now she also feels that she's in the right position and also from the things that she has learned throughout this process she is able perhaps to encourage other people who are going through a heartbreak and hence why she feels that a workshop would fit well because she has a lot to share that she cannot do in one day but this workshop will go for two weeks so that is something that she's planning right now and you might be wondering who needs a workshop for breakup well there are people who are actually going through it and they just need that help to just get over this breakup so as you can see she got a message when you're ready to talk about how you do it share because i look at you and i say she's strong i took almost six months for things to start looking normal i avoided my house yani i was always at my mom's or friends or out and lydia responded i have been thinking of how to intentionally help go through heartbreak so, so why she will be having this workshop a better breakup workshop where you feel you deal you heal and you move well would you go to a breakup workshop how do you deal with breakups or how did you deal with your worst breakup you can let others know in the comment section down below perhaps there's somebody who needs that but also you can get the help from Lydia through this workshop so you can deal with it and move on with your life smoothly well that's it for today thanks so much for watching don't forget to subscribe please turn on your post notifications so you're notified once new uploads are up and i'll see you on the next one bye bye